You've come to this video because Apache failed to start. In your browser, instead of the welcome page, you've probably got a blank, empty browser window. And in the XM control panel, you've probably got error messages in red. Normally, this is due to another program accessing the web and blocking the ports which Apache is trying to use. The error message should tell you what program is doing this, and then you have to either close that program, or change its port settings, or change the ports that Apache is using. Nine times out of ten, it's Skype which is causing the problem, as it is here. The report shows that port 80 and port 443 are in use by Skype. To solve this, start up Skype, go to Tools, Options, Advanced, Connection, and deselect the checkbox Use Port 80 and 443 for additional incoming connections. Click Save. This does not take effect until the next time you start Skype. So quit and restart Skype. And if you want, you can go to Tools, Options, Advanced, Connection again, and just check that that's taken effect. Then, in the XM control panel, try to start Apache. And it should start now. And in your browser, go to http colon forward slash forward slash localhost, and you should see the XAMPP welcome page now. If that does not solve the problem, then look at the error messages in the control panel, in the XAMPP control panel for the offending program blocking ports 80 and 443. If you can live without that program, shut it down, or change its settings in a similar way to what we just did in Skype. If you cannot change the offending program's settings, or you can't live without it, if you can't solve the problem at that end, you can change the settings for Apache instead. And we'll do that in the next video.